I did want to go inside the low tunnel and uh, see what it looks like in there. Let's check it out. So we're here in the low tunnel and uh, it's actually quite pleasant in here. It's below freezing outside, but in here uh, it's nice and warm. As you can see, we've got row cover here and there's actually a little bit of ice formed on here. Um, this is our, our first layer here on the hoops. And then on top of this, we put greenhouse uh, poly plastic. And the nice thing about these two layers is that, uh, I guess if I take my glove off, I feel that it's nice and warm in here. If I feel the air that's kind of insulating between the, the plastic and the row cover, it's much, it's cooler inside here. And so this creates two, uh, two barriers, a really good insulative value to a low tunnel. Let's take a look at some of the plants and how they're performing since it's been so cold uh, this uh, kind of late part of November. The kale is looking great. Uh, kale does wonderful even without season extension. Uh, one of the crops that I was a little bit concerned about was the salvanella lettuce. And uh, there is a little bit of frost damage on that. You can see it in the, the margins have this like black uh, tips to them. That's cold damage on them. But as a whole, the heads of lettuce, they've survived remarkably well. Uh, they are harvestable. You know, we could probably pick some right now and make a, a good salad out of them. The spinach, uh, we've gotten three cuts in the spinach, and I think we're going to get at least one more off of that. The spinach is, is looking great. The carrots are looking awesome, too. Uh, again, we're just holding these throughout the winter. We're going to be harvesting them off and on uh, throughout the winter months here, and we're, we'll have a video about that later. Let's check out some of the other crops down the way here. So had some some cabbage left over and we just let it go we let it grow and it's still doing great in here actually i think we're gonna get uh we are getting a, a head of cabbage uh, start to develop here we have some turnips left over some there's some swiss chard we have some bok choy uh so all of this is still alive and well despite the fact that it's been getting down into the low 20s for the last several nights it's been very very windy uh and uh, i've actually been very happy that the low tunnel has stayed in place with the, the winds that we've been having. But otherwise, I'm very pleased uh, with the low tunnel. I had to get it up really quickly, as you saw earlier in the video, uh, but it's done amazingly well. We'll check in at a later date when the weather gets better. Have a good day. Thanks for watching.